Moving on, Jubilee Party Secretary Jeremiah Kioni now wants Deputy President Rigathi Gashagwa to name top officials in retired President Uhuru Kenyatta's government who, he, who allegedly looted at least 24 billion shillings from the National Treasury. Gashagwa had claimed that 10 billion shillings was stolen during the presidential election petition, while another 6 billion was pilfered two days before the August 9th polls. On Sunday, DGG promised that he will give us the names of the people who received money that was carried by police officers to a police air wings, Pale Wilson, Masaduku. Kwa Masaduku, Wale Ambao, Wali Patiwa, Hiso Pesa. Now he promised to give the names by today, Wednesday. Wednesday, Bado Ejeisha, Imebakia Masamasita, Kabla Midnight. Na Nataka Kurudia Tena. Alisema, Yeye Mwenyewe Atapatia na Majina ya Wale Ambao, Wali Pelekua Pesa. na masaduku na wale ambao walipeba pesa hizo ni askari wakitumia kwenda mpaka police airwing sasa wewe mwenyewe ujiulize wa Kenya askari ndio wametumia wametumia kuiba pesa za Kenya na askari ndio wanatakana kurida pesa za Kenya na zimelepelekewa watu ambao ligejia na jua na akasema atawastaja leo usiku ama leo kabla ya saa sita usiku tunagojea but before that what has happened sasa tunaona tena saraka zingine Ya kusema ya kwamba e, ya tani alihakikisha ya kwamba pesa simetorewa pali e, ziko kwa jia ya isiofa. The controller of budget has constitutional protection to his office, all her office. And we have also seen the DPP behave the same way. If they succumbed to pleasure, other than what is provided for under the constitution, then they have already breached the constitution or the oath that they took when they are the was getting those offices na kitu ya kwanza wanatakana ni kujihuzuru kwa sababu hawana uwezo wa kufanya kazi kwa zile maofisi hata wakati huu chini ya kampuni ya Rigiji na William kwanza kampuni ibaya kuliko serikali na tunaelewa ya kwamba hii ni jama tu ya kufuruga na kujaribu kuonjana na kwamba serikali ya jubilee haikufanya chochote chini ya uli, chini ya uongozi wa eh, our party leader eh, uhuru muigai kenyata kwa hivyo hii ni, ni vita ambayo tunaiona na ni kama lazima sasa tutijitayarishe hii kampuni imeafugua vita tu hawana mambo mengine isipokuwa ni vita we know that the 15 billion shillings that was with the drone was with the drone and it was aimed at specific ministries and specific projects within those ministries na haina maana ya kuwahada wa Kenya ya kwamba kuna pesa silipelekwa na askari airwing na ikaenda kwa watu wengine mabinafsi